mind-blowing. It's super cool. It is explode. Some of the features just allow for some really, really creative type of play. And I'm excited to see what you do. So in this particular preset, Explode Sky, I have one preset, sorry, one button, A. That's going up seven semitones, but you can see that we have the control of the rise and fall. What's even more crazy is you can set this to sync. So if you want to sync these rise and falls in time with your beats and song, you can also do that, which is absolutely wild. For the purpose here, I'm just going to leave sync off. So let me show you what that rise and fall actually does. So the speed, sorry, the, the time that I set to rise. <laughs> is set here and once I hit that pitch this is the speed that it returns back down to pitch. So what I think is really cool is when you have a very very fast return to pitch but then you have a slow rise up because what you can do then is like let's say you want to have like a an octave like slow down but when you release that pedal, it goes right back to concert pitch. So what I mean is, if I hit a chord, as soon as I lift, I'm back in my concert pitch. You could go all the way up an octave. Mm. Or you could have the, uh, the whammy pedal go up two octaves. It's like, it's just absolutely berserk. And I'm only myself starting to scratch the surface of what you can do with Explode. It's just so much fun. I love it and I think you are going to love it too. One thing I always thought about was when you have a trem, wouldn't it be cool if you could bend chords, right? Because like, if you have a trem, it doesn't work. You can't bend whole chords because of the relationship between the string. But with Explode here, You can. So if I put on like a Prodigy-esque style beat. So right there, I'm using Explode to kind of reach notes that would be impossible to, to get to. So I'm tapping. Now what's kind of cool is I can stay, I can hold that uh, Explode down. And choose when to release it. And obviously I can also choose the speed. So right there, I kind of have this instant sort of switch back, but when I hit explode, I can 
can slow that down. Uh, so if I really want to get, really exaggerate the sort of speed going up to that high up five, and maybe a similar return. <laughs> You have full control over that. I, I I like to kind of do fast up and slow down and slow up and then fast return. So you kind of, I don't know, there's, there's something that I like about that, but you're gonna have to let me know what uh, what's your favorite uh, settings for Explode. I'm still, still grasping it as this is one of the last things that we finished uh, before wrapping up the, the, the launch version of Nunchuck. So I still get super excited every time I play with it. I'm going to stop it there otherwise I'll be here playing with those tones all day long so nunchuck it's out now head to the polychrome dsp.com website download the demo take it for a spin for yourself see what you think let me know what you think and I'll see you back here real soon all right take care